Halloween night. That's probably my error and looking at it, you try to position these two exhibition games in a good way leading up to your season opener where you have the right room. And uh, to choose Halloween this week and election night next week, <laughs> if you ever want to find out the passion of our fans, we're going to really test them here. And uh, I know we also play on Christmas Day. And our red blue game is at 2 o'clock on Sunday. So, <laughs> Uh, but we have the greatest fans in the world, and we appreciate them being here. And it's always good that they're here in these exhibition games because it allows our young players to get their feet wet in playing in front of a big crowd, which you think that they're used to it, they're not. And the more that they get game experience in this type of environment, the better for the long haul. Uh, big difference between a year ago and this year's team is the obvious, just bigger. And uh, our, our size comes with depth. We play Kevin and Solomon at the three, and one of the challenges is for us to utilize that size to our advantage all the time. And what I mean by that is, although we out-rebounded, humbled, and we did a good job in and around the basket, you know, for our team to give up nine of 19 from three, you're really playing with fire. And uh, I thought some of Humboldt's open threes came because of our rotation and just the irresponsibility. You think about us fouling the jump shooter four times in one game. I think we fouled the three-point shooter three times. If there's a positive spin on it, you can imagine the outcome of the game or how, how much we could have done even better defensively. Uh, so that's something that we have to work on, and I, I'm confident that we'll get better 